Hi everybody, I'm the crew here. Today we're back on our modded survival, and I said a couple of episodes ago in episode 6 or 7, or I can't remember what episode it was, but I said what the name of the thing was called, and I forgot to put it in the title of the video, so I'll just say it again, and that'll be, hopefully, the name will be in the next episode. So it is called Tiny Tiger Survival, and... I pretty liked that name, and I can't remember who it was by, but I'll, I can probably tell you that in the next video, so shout out to them if they did it. And I'm now going to be doing something, and you can probably tell we've got some weird things in our inventory. Like we've got some bees, and if I go over here into the village, you can, like, if I can find it, I trapped this villager. Because I've been looking through the recipes out of video, and I I saw it was quite easy to make the Tinker, like well not Tinker's stuff, but Tinker's construct, but the like the like Tinker table and stuff. So yeah, now we've got an emerald which we need a Meadows drone. I don't think that will work. No. So right, let's just let this guy out. There we go, sir. There we go. And it looks like we can trade to us an emerald for a proven frame. So we'll just let that guy out and then we can go back to our base. And I was looking around out of video, but I didn't want to mine it out of video. But I saw this cave and it's pretty close to our base. And there is a certain something in there. Ah, here's the cave. Look. So there's a cave and you can probably tell there... There's diamonds. Dun dun dun. Ugh. Right, let's just stand up here. There we go, we got a diamond. So yeah, that just keeps on going down and down and down into the deep thing. So we just get a bit more redstone. Don't know what all this is. It's probably appetite or something, yes. It's appetite. Alright. Now I can we can work on getting some of the tinkers tinkering stuff like the power armor and, but first we need the tinker table tinker there it is power armor tinker table so we need iron lapis and an emerald and we've got iron we've got an emerald from that villager and hopefully we've got some lapis left from creating our armor so let's go into precious yes we've just more or less just the right amount get a bit of iron out of our thingers here because I think we're going to need a bit of that so now let's go down here we can craft it so it was there we go so we have made the tinker table we can put that somewhere down over here and put it in this actually we put it in we will put it down here but we'll put it different place of the machine so yeah look that's what it looks like it looks pretty cool so now we need to make the power the um power tool like the p-o-w-e-r here it is the power claunt or whatever so it's wiring and iron and i looked out out of episode how to make the iron so we put some redstone in the middle redstone boom boom there we go eight wiring I have a feeling we're going to need some more things. And we've got two iron ingots on us, so that is handy dandy. There we go. Shift click. And here we go. We've got our power tool. Ah. Don't know why it's not showing in our hand. Might be a bit glitchy. Yeah, it looks like it's a bit glitchy. So now let's go over to our tinker table and we click on this. So we're going to need an axe and we're going to, well mainly things we're going to need is the pickaxe. So we need three and then get and a solenoid, a solenoid. So let's work out how to make S-O-L-E, a solenoid. So it's wiring and iron. So let's go upstairs and get some of our iron. I'll just take all of it out for now. I'm going to put some back. So we see, and we've got some, we need to make some more wiring. There we go. Let's 
Then I might have made four then. There we go. And then it was iron down the middle. So it's a solenoid. So now we can make our first adjustment onto our pickaxe. So we add it as a pickaxe and install. Overclock we won't need. So now if we click shift, install modules, pickaxe. So we put that in the pickaxe slot for now. So now this should work. For some reason it's not. Maybe you do need an overclock on it. Don't know why that's not working. If we break this, it's probably just going to shatter. Yes. Let's quick shift. Right. Press shift more for more information. So it's got pickaxe installed modules pickaxe. And if we go in F5, got a quite a cool thing on our hand. Ugh. So let's install like a shovel or something on here and see if that's working. We need another solenoid. So it looks like we're gonna need quite a lot of solenoids, so we'll make some of them. Like that. Oh what was that? You can make a control rod, whatever that is. Boom. And there we go, we've just got enough for another solenoid. And we've got some still we've got some iron left, so we should be end up with 30 left. Shovel install. Harvest speed. Don't know why this isn't working. Going pretty quick, but not that quick. Oh, I think I know why. Hmm, no. Don't know why that's not working. Maybe if we just install like something that's not digging onto it, it will. Omni wrench, lux, shears. It could be shears. A ro to roller. Making easy. To, don't know what that is. A rail gun. So six solenoids and a HV capacitor. We should make some more. I think. Yeah, let's make the rail gun. So we need to make some more wiring. So there's redstone in the middle. There, boom. There we go. We got seventeen wiring. Um. We got two, so we need to get some more wiring. Which means we're going to have to get some more iron ingots. So if we look up here. So in our precious. And we're going to need some more gold. Ah, there we go. We've got some in here. Uh, oh, Alright, so. Oh, bit of lag there. Back to game. There we go. Alright, so. What was it we needed? Ah, yes. Wiring. That in the middle. Boom, boom. There we go, 45 wiring. That is a lot of wiring. Put one down there. Three, three. There we go. Three, three. Nope. Three, so two, three, four, five. So one more we're going to need. There we go. Four. There we go. Just get that on out. Put that in, in like that. There we go. Six solenoids. And a HV capacitor. So a HV. No, not HC. HV capacitor. So we need glowstone dust. 
wiring and ender pearl and glass. The glowstone dust is going to be the hardest. Glowstone essence, so yeah. Looks pretty hard. So we're going to need to go to the nether. Which means we're going to need some more obsidian. So first let's go to sleep. So right, right, it's morning now. So what else can we install on our power claw? A plasma cannon. A rail gun. Supersonic speed magnets force heavy recoil. A plasma cannon is... So a blade launcher launches spilling, spinning blade death or shearing. So we need a servo motor and a MF capacitor. capacitor. Ah, look, there's special stuff down here. So we need in place and assembler, a control circuit, a diamond drill. That's, so right, we need a crafting table and a control circuit. So let's type in a control. Control. No. Con. Control circuit. Here it is. So we need gold. Glowstone dust. Yeah, so it looks like we're going to need to go to the nether. So, right, how are we going to do this? Um... But we'll probably do that in the next episode. We'll go adventuring for some more, like, obsidian. Or we'll go mining. I don't know why this isn't working. It works for an axe, but we haven't even installed the axe. Yeah, well. So, right. We're going to end the episode here. So, thank you very much for watching. And we'll see you all later.